ho, spooky opening. Hello, my friends. It's Professor Hans Lloyd Puppet coming at you on a Friday night. Oh, it's late. It's seven o'clock. Maybe my latest one yet. Whoa, another scary Friday night with no date. Oh, wow, this day really got away from me, you know. I had to go to the garage this morning to take my car in and then... You know, I had a client and a meeting, and then I got to a 3D grafting project. Grafting? Grifting? Drafting project. Uh, earlier, that took like hours longer than I expected. And uh, so anyway, here I am. So let's do this thing. Let's get to it. How, who's here? How you doing? Steve is here. He's got an hour before lunch. Artie, hello. Jim is back. What does Jared say? Sorry for not being present. Uh, that's all right. Don't worry about it, buddy. I'm here for you. Don't worry about it. You don't have to show up on my account. All right, let's do this thing, shall we? All right, let's take a look at this. Puzzle. Okay. How about a little mini pause to warm our brains up? Before we get to the Friday. Look, the best ever was a 13-minute Friday. Usually a lot, lot harder than that. Okay. Wow, that's this is a mini? It's kind of a maxi mini. Like seven by seven. Come on. That's going to take at least a whole minute. Let's see. Bookstore chain that went back rupt in 2011. Uh, I don't know. Rotten. Bad. Uh, not get a good, not get a good deal. Overpay? So it's Borders. I remember Borders. Part of Alphabet City. Avenue. A-V-E-N-U. Avenue A. Uh, ten-sided shape. Deck, uh, gone. Uh, one use of Yelp. Or oh, TripAdvisor. Uh, uh, removed from the market, as it recalls. Evidence of paternity suit. DNA test. Uh, women's tennis star. Bush, I don't know. Or oh, Rater uses that. Sweetener in a yellow packet. That's a P there. That would be, uh, Splendor. Uh, artificial eyelashes, slangly. Lashes, right? Bay Area Airport is SLO, right? Oyster. Uh, Less recalls. LA, what? No, it's SFO. Falsies. 132. Hello, Captain Swag Bolly. Welcome back. All right. 132. That was, uh, it's like a whole puzzle. But, uh, okay, whatever. Not that exciting, not that funny or anything. Let's get to the next thing here. Let's do this. I can't tell how many people are logged in. It doesn't say on my screen here. But I see I've got one, two, three, four, five, six unique viewers commenting. So that's nice. So far, so good. Let's see who else we can get to come in. The world watches California. Okay. <whistles> Daily Crosswood. No extra info up here. Friday is always the hard puzzle. One of the hardest of the week. But let's get... Come on. Get up there. Let's get started. Come on. Get in the right place. Okay. Toilet paper. What? It's like the news of, of poop. Toilet paper. Uh... Have many openings. Hiring? Have many openings. Powerful Russian. Could be a czar. Could be Putin. V-L-A-D-I. I mean, Vladimir could be it. I doubt it, though. Fancy affair is a gala or a soiree. Uh, Coca-Cola product since 2001. Dasani? Coca-Cola product. Could be anything. Cafe chain. Denny's? Uh, OG original gangster rapper. This one I don't know. Hello, Coconut. Good evening. Over sentimental, overly sentimental writers. Oh, boy. Uh, Unipero Blank. Father, father, oh, Unipero Sarah, right? I 
think that's it. Could be spelled wrong. Arizona athlete for short. Sun devil. Right? Just devil. Uh, wake me up when it starts. What are you talking about, Jim? We're here. Oh, you're not? So now it says I'm live. Have you guys not been watching all this all this time? Wow. I've been, I've been going for a minute for... Oh, you know what? I guess it said I wasn't live, but I was getting comments all the time. Anyway, I said a lot of nice things about all of you. So, uh, so anyway, here we go. Media company led by the Salzberger family. Aye, 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 four minutes. Actually, I see my elapsed time here now. It says a minute and 20, minute and 30 seconds. So I guess it uh, has, a, I guess, Friday night. A lot of, lot of traffic. Anyway, I'm glad you're all here. Let's go back. Who's here? Uh, Steve, Jim, Jared, Artie, Captain Swag Barley, Callie, uh, Coconut, Jim, I said already, and Panda is here. So welcome, all of you. So I hope you don't want to feel left out. Okay, here we go. Media company left the Salzburger family. I had no idea. Events with tents. Circuses? Oh. Circai? Is that, how, is that a thing? I don't know. Uh, really bugged. Eight at. Era of Neil deGrasse Tyson's Star Talk. Is it sci-fi? Sci-fi channel? No, it's uh, Discovery. Is it Nat Geo? I think it is. Uh, become edible. <whistles> become edible would be to ripen. Okay. Kind of coordination. I hand. Maybe. Be charged. Oh, I, I've been charged. I'm in jail. Uh, touristy area on the Irish coast? No idea what's this. Part of 24 across. Media company. Part of a media company. Oh boy. Could be NBC. I don't know though. Wiccan groups, covens. That's where witches hang out. <coughs> okay, here we go. Uh, affairs. That's good. Okay, what's this area? Oh, I like that. Feature of a telephone area code. Area code page. Area code PH. There we go. Any man or boy, biblically, son of God. <coughs> Sorry, son of Adam. That makes sense. Okay, what does it say? A teat. A that. Okay, collection of posts about a trip. Travel. Blog. hey -o. We're getting somewhere here. Aha. Uh -huh. uh, okay. You just wrote something. Okay, here we go. Balkan capital Sophia. Good old Sophia. Things held in a cannonball? What? Things held in a cannonball. <coughs> Place to watch a race for short. OTB. Off track betting. Tony once nominated for an Emmy. Tony Danza. For for what? Who's the boss? Blank May Lester of Erskine Caldwell's Tobacco Road. Uh, Alina? I don't know. Vitamin rich green side dish. Hmm. No idea. Setback. Setback is a... Hmm. Something. Oh, I think page is probably wrong because GM is no way to end a thing. Vitamin rich setback. Blank center. Ah. Oh, knees on a cannonball. Oh, you said that. 
Jim, you rascal, you haven't got this solved already, have you? You hold your knees when you do a cannonball. That's crazy. Popular vodka brand from Holland. Absolute. It's my absolute, you know, favorite vodka. Not really. They're all the same. Vodkas are vodka. Uh, front spoiler in a car. Front spoilers. Ground effects, they're called the 8500. Um, like many people on January... One resolute? No. Uh, hungover. That's what it is. Uh, I th I feel like you're like a minute behind on the comments. I could say something. I just noticed it came in. It's it's, it's really lagging behind. So if I don't uh, get your thingies, uh, forgive me. Fancified. Uh, ornate. Maybe. Nope, not enough letters for ornate. My computer's very sluggish, too. Space is out. Veggies. What's this? Has a ethnic group whose name means warriors. The uh, Hajkanasi? What's this? Sombrero, for example. Sombrero's a hat. Uh, I don't totally dance this right. Uh, I think it's right. I know because he, he's a TV star, you know. What's that you say? Air dam? Never would I heard of that. Okay. Where is it? Here. Hmm. The planets, for example. The planets, the planets. Gateway of a Shinto shrine. It's like an arch or something. Get on board. There we go. That I can answer. Okay, Fox Isle Islands resident. Fox Islands. Uh... Albatross, Fox Islands. No idea. They have big mouths. Rivers? Uh, uh, spiral horned antelope. It's a, it's a kudu. I knew that. Okay, oblate? Come on, Jim. Italian sauce. Of smoke. What? It's the Pope. Italian sauce of smoke. What the fuck does that mean? Uh huh. Okay, this is wrong. OG salad? Could be egg salad, it could be cob salad. I think it's gotta be egg salad. So is this. Is absolute the wrong vodka? Popular Holland vodka. Oh, Belvedere. Nope. Does this have two? Okay, blog. This has got two G's in it, whatever this is. Space is out. Veg out. V E G E S. Veggies are mm, complicated. Fancified. Hmm. Weird. What's this? Area code. Ah, uh, greens. Oaked. Smoked. Fine rich green side dish. Is smoked? Do you smoke a vegetable? Uh, wow. I kind of feel like there's a lot of wrong things here. Oh, kettle one, of course. 
That's a good vodka. Uh, they have big mouths. Ewers? Okay, space is out. Oh, an Aleut is an is an Eskimo, and an, the Aleutian Islands, you see. Uh, oh, Etna, Mount Etna. It's a volcano. That's an Italian smoker. Space is out. Staggers. Oh, yeah, staggers. Oh, not like trips and staggers, but like, um, you know, you stagger their arrivals. Okay. Something about love here. Uh, it's a Donna Summer song. Setback is a blow. Many British retirees are pensioner. They get pensions because of good old socialism. Uh, Ellie May Lester? I had an Aunt Ellie. Died a few years ago. Request for backup. You know what? I haven't done the ups and downs. He's on the top half of the puzzle. I'll st I like prefer whiskey to vodka as well. Smoked kale. Ugh. Kazakhs. There we go. That, nope, not you. It's got the feedback. It's just so slow on this browser today. Cork, drink, a sombrero is a drink, huh, let's get up here, let's, let's try some ups and downsies here, Pueblo Revolt participants, I don't know, <laughs> I want to know what love is too, Kelly, I want to know what love is too. Uh, it's going to be I Feel Love, probably. I Feel Love. All right, what's this? 30s, 40s, some star with a signature song. You'll never know just how much I love you. A highlight of The Shape of Water, if you've seen it. You'll never know just how much I care a million or more times. Okay. This Vladimir is stupid. Okay, Pueblo, you went away and my heart went with you. I hear your name with my every prayer. Unshackles. That's going to end in S. If there was some other way to prove that I love you, I swear I don't know how. Right, gay rights. Uh, you'd never know if you don't know now. Okay, cause associated with the rainbow flag. Well, it's uh, it's uh, gay rights, but that's not enough letters. Hmm. Blank Americana. Newspaper section. News, sports. Liberates. There we go. Damn it, damn it, Jim. You embarrass me. Uh -huh. Newspaper section. Want ads, funny paper, comics, business, arts, arts. There we go. Uh, oh, LGBT. Thank you. That's the word I was looking for. LGBT. Why is it G first, I wonder? I don't know. Ladies first, I suppose. Uh, Provincetown Catch. Weekly Jewish Observance. Oh, that's uh, that's a Sabbath. So this is not a tat. Really bug. Torat and Devil is probably wrong too. S 
Scrot, really? Come on. Seriously? That's a funny word for a fish. Request backup. Uh, isn't bad. Isn't bad? It wins. Fancify oneself. Okay. Sometimes specific overtures. Commodore. Uh, Passover. No, no. Oh, you can't. Uh, what can't you do on Passover? Yeast. Right? You can't have leavened bread, right? Could be a yeast. I mean, if soiree is right. I don't know. What's the sob? Overly sentimental writers. Scrot card. Well, I don't card. Codfish is what you get for your fish and chips. What's this? With the evil. Suddenly took notice. Hmm. <coughs> really bugged. <clears throat> Corker? Maybe, maybe it's Shabbat. I like that better. Because hmm. then these look better, like a BB tra, you say? Coca-Cola. Oh, Tab Ultra. No, Pib? Okay, OG Gangster. Pow oh, oligarchs. Like the ones running the United States right now. Oligarchs. Okay, a powerful oligarch. Yeah, there we go. So, yeah, okay, we're happy with that. Okay. Toilet paper. F hall, uh, ha oh! A hall pass. To the paper to take you to the toilet. Pan American. You see this LGBT though? That should be a vowel there. What do we got here? Pueblo Revolt. Participants. Hopis? Oh, Alice Fay. Good old Alice Fay. Uh, Pib? Pib Intra? Hall Pass? Ice Tea. Okay. So Pib Entra? Is it Pip or Pip Extra? There we go. That makes a lot more sense. Oh boy. All right. So, so Scrod checks out. What do we got here? Really bugged. I'll go back to 8 at. Good. Uh, became edible. Would be become edible to turn ripe. Right? Uh, be charged. What's this with the ES? Some tech grads for short. Uh, be charged. Okay, what's this? There's a CK here. A timekeeper. It's a spice rack. So, cafe chain pennies? Is that a cafe chain? Uh, suddenly took notice. Sat up. Uh, D back. Uh, what's this? Panafa. Be charged. Oh, pay a fee. There we go. Ease. Electrical engineers, EEs, PIP extra, okay. Yeah, Shabbat, I know what Shabbat is, but it's the same word as Sabbath. 
Okay. Okay. Sob sisters. Request backup. Anyone. Isn't bad. Oh. Fancify oneself. Or ornate. Commodore. Passover. No, no. Pennies is wrong. Let's check it out. Maybe if this is this yeast. Because she does have unleavened bread, you know. Having many openings. Be airy. No. Cafe chain. Sob sisters, maybe. Never heard that term, though. Media company led by the Salzberger family. What's this? West Cork. Okay, West Cork, I got it. Which is, so new is part of NYT, New York Times, maybe? Commodore Perry. That's how you spell a soiree. With two E's on the end. There we go. Fancify oneself. Panera. Yes. <laughs> I don't think of it as a cafe. It's more of a bread store. Dupreen. Okay. Uh, have many openings. Would be Gappy. Right? Isn't bad. Eight. Oh, eight. Be good, bad. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Request for backup. Go ask anyone. That's funny. So, D back. Arizona State. Oh, the diamond back. Diamond backs. I get it. Okay. All right. We're doing well here. The planets. Uh, what's this TM? Maybe it's not smoked kale. Something. Baked kale? No. Cooked kale? Could be cooked kale. Eric Code. or something. The planets, for example. Oh, an octet. Or an octad. Eight planets. Fancified did up. Get your do done. Area code map, of course. And a trauma center. Oops, after it up. TR. Hey, look at that. No mistakes. Fancy that. Ho, ho, ho. Twenty four fifty nine. That's not too bad, guys. That's not too ding dang bad. I mean, if Panera is well, I don't know. It's, I guess, to me, <coughs> to me, <coughs> a cafe. Because cafe is the French word for coffee. A cafe is a coffee shop. It's where you go to have a coffee and a thing. A coffee and a biscuit. A coffee and a cake. Coffee and a hamburger or something, you know? Cafe means coffee. You get your coffee in a cafe. I mean, I guess they have coffee at Panera, but it's it's more about the bread, I guess, technically. It's more of a sandwich shop. Now, you know there's a great controversy. Is a hot dog a sandwich? That's another new thing that's been invented for us to argue about, you know? Is a hot dog a sandwich? What do you guys think? I'm just curious. I know the right answer, but I'm curious what you think it is. Let's see. Hottest one. No, Saturday's harder, Panda. I think Saturday's actually much harder. But yeah, it's, it's one harder. I did the Saturday one by myself this week. Oh, my God. It was bonkers. It took forever. I had to keep checking things. Ugh. Cafe. So, but what do you think? Is a hot dog a sandwich? Hmm? This is a great kind of like, what's the sound of one hand clapping? A question to open your mind. Is a hot dog a sandwich? Hmm? 
The hot dog stands alone with the cheese. Okay. Do you say so? Anybody else? Anybody else? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Okay, listen. Uh, no, a hot dog is not a sandwich. It's a thing between bread. If a hot dog is a sandwich, everything is a sandwich. You know, a lot of people say, well, it's, it's you know, it's a hot dog. It's, it's between bread. Of course it's a sandwich. You know, it's not. You know, it's, a, it's a slit bun as opposed to two pieces of bread. Right, you're right, Jim. A quesadilla or a taco would be a sandwich. So I agree, not a sandwich. My point is, okay, here's how to win. Uh, I don't think so. Okay, coconut, say more. Why? Why is a coconut a sandwich, hot uh, coconut? Because I'll tell you how to win this argument. I meant bread between, meat between bread is the sandwich. Well, uh, no, not necessarily. Because here's the reason why. Words are meant to mean things. They're for communicating, for, for communicating between people. Now, you could be pedantic and say a tomato is a fruit or a hot dog is a sandwich because it's meat between bread, but it's wrong. Because uh, if you sliced up hot dogs and put them between two slices of bread, sure, that's a hot dog sandwich. That makes My mother used to make them like that. I found it very aggravating as a child. But listen, words are meant to mean something. If you said, bring me a sandwich... That's what brought you a hot dog. You'd be like, that is a hot dog. I, I was expecting a, you know, a flat thing with meat between bread. You know, if you said, I'm going to bring you a sandwich. And then you brought someone a hot dog. That's not what they're expecting. When you say sandwich, a picture goes into your head of what a sandwich is. And that's what you should call it. You shouldn't try to offer someone a sandwich, then slip them a hot dog on a technicality. Okay? Right. Tomatoes are fruit because they have seeds inside, and so are pumpkins. But when you say, I'd like to get some fruit, would you like some fruit? Someone goes, yes, I would love some fruit. They're expecting a banana or an apple or a pear or something. You hand them a pumpkin, they're going to punch you in the face. So listen, don't be pedantic. Words mean things, okay? Technically, what they mean is not as important as what people understand them to mean. So use words correctly. You know? Like, uh... You might not say, like if you said, bring me a bunch of vegetables and you just brought tomatoes and pumpkins, people say, well, that's not really what I had in mind either. You want like green leafy vegetables. You want, you know, beans and green beans and broccoli and things like that, you know? But uh, the other answer to that I learned is that um, a fruit is a classification. Things are or are not fruit, but vegetable is is not. Vegetable is a class that's bigger than fruit. Like fruit, fruit goes under the canopy of vegetables. But in common, asking for some vegetables to go as a side dish, what you're talking about is, um, you know, green leafy stuff. Anyway, but that's not as important. I like using the word pedantic. I tend to annoy people with tomatoes as fruit. Well, you know, if, if you like annoying people, then you, you figure it out there, you know? Uh, <laughs> maybe. Maybe, Callie, maybe. You put a bunch of hot dogs just side by side between two pieces of bread? Sure, that's a hot dog sandwich. It's not uh, like a hot dog. He said, like the same thing. You know, that's not a hot dog. That That is hot dogs on a sandwich. But if you said, I'm going to bring you a hot dog. And then you brought someone a bunch of hot dogs between two pieces of rye bread. They're going to go, that's not what I had in mind. Okay. So let's all agree. Words are for communicating. Let's try to be clear with each other and not try to trick each other with pedancy. I think we really learned a lot today, don't you? All right. On that note, let's 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 call it today. Let's 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 log off. We're online for half an hour. Actually, I got no work done today. Well, I got a lot of work done, but not for the client who's expecting it tomorrow. So now I gotta knuckle down and do some more work. Yeah, vegetables, culinary fruits, botanically. All right. Now you know what I want a hot dog. Damn it. All right, guys. Thank you for playing. This has been a lot of fun tonight. Uh, I see you soon. Okay. Maybe tomorrow, maybe not. We'll see. I got a new Airbnb person from China coming in tomorrow. And they might be a little bit uh, weirded out by all of this hazari we got going on here. But maybe not. We'll see. Uh, if I get an opportunity, I'll see you again very soon. Okay? If not, have a lovely weekend. Later, my friends. Ciao for now.